Okay, there we go. Recording issues off the bat. Boy, we're off to a good start. We need to go get those treasure chests. There might be something good in them. Also, we need to go hit Yang in the face with a frying pan. It's the best mission ever. Meh. I'm not wasting eight magic points to not take two damage. We need to go north. I'm not sure, though. We might have already gone that way. Boo! Frog ladies. Wait, didn't we go first? We were surprised. Kane, we need you to jump on people, you dick. I suppose I could just run away. Where's the sense in that, though? <clears throat> Damn, she's fast. No, don't do that. Uh, okay, well, Rosa is untoted. Good God! I know it's just a tiny frog, but that's a hell of a lot of damage. No, no sense in that. Okay, turn Cecil back to normal. Don't frog edge. You assholes. Eh, that'll work. You can't stop me. I'll do it to myself. Oh, Rosa, you were supposed to go first. Meh, whatever. This works. <laughs> you bitch. That's okay. Stop turning us into frogs. My god. Oh, yeah. That's the light sword. I meant to look up and see if that did lightning damage. Good god, Edge! I wonder if it does more damage because it's the mute thing and she's a wizard. Yeah, fire three. That's cool. No, I thought that cost less magic. Also, we need to do a thing. Do, do, do. <clears throat> do a thing, yes. Cause reasons. Okay, this time we will. No. Eh. Oh, cure four. That's nifty. I've probably already been up north, but damned if I can remember. Yeah, I think we went up there because there was a treasure. Right? Yeah, there's a treasure. Okay, we can go back. I think there's a middle path we're supposed to take. That's the only one we didn't really take. <clears throat> what are you? Ghosties! I'll fight ghosties. Uh, sure. Oh, right, that doesn't work. Why are you going first? has something to do with who you have in the middle slot. Avenger! Arrgh, angry Cecil! Arrgh. Kill? All the kill! Ooh! That did work, okay. Must have done that to someone else it didn't work on. Muchas experiences. That's Albanian for very many's. Oops. Hey, Rose is at the top now. That's cool. Nope, don't do that. Um. Oh, I don't know. I like all these spells. Edge has a great many hit points. Wait, did I float? I think I forgot to. I forgot to float. Get him, Cecil. Oh, stop that shit. Ah, I still got him. Oh, well, Jin ought to fix their little red wagon. Hey, he unconfused himself. Good stuff. God damn. Don't be a tiny frog. You take lots of damage. Oh, that's pretty good. Oh, yeah. That's 
christen the fire three. Don't eat the rightia. That's just as bad as beating up the tiny froggy. Come on, rightia, blow him up. We believe in you, girl. I don't know, I like the picture we had yesterday, but I always kind of thought her character sprite looks like it has a big leaf on her head. I mean, I guess it looks... You can, you can see it. Hey, levels! We're gonna need levels. Where we're going, we're gonna need all kinds of levels. Son of a bitch! I forgot to float again! It's like I don't even know how to play this game. I think this one. Or is this the one I already took? No. Yay. I think I need to float against something later on. Damned if I can remember what. <coughs> There's a boss you need to float against. Uh, whatever. Murder them all. Sweet lord, Edge. Edge has had enough of these damn frogs. You didn't turn yourself into a frog. <clears throat> kind of insulted. Well, wherever Kane is, I hope he's getting some experience for us. Ugh. Ghosties. Okay, then. My goodness. Well, it's nice that this dungeon's easier. Because we're going to a new and exciting fresh hell. Oh boy. Let's see, what do we have to do after this? We need to go see Yang. See Yang's wife again. There might be... Is there another trap chest? Oh, Elmo Arrows. That was hardly worth it. Oh, you guys. This is kind of nice, because I guess Rydia goes first. Hmm. I wonder if we move Rosa further down. That'll make her make Cecil go first. Yay! All the Leviathan. Let's try that. I like having Rosa and Cecil next to each other, though. Because she's his waifu. the little girl in Robot Chicken. This is Cecil. And this is Rosa. They're married. And draw a big red heart around them. Are we there? I think we're there. I'm gonna have to go through another door. Oh no. Okay, still Rydia. And still Rosa. Okay. Hmm. Maybe it's an actual based on their agility thing. She's just gotten faster than everybody. You think she'd be... You think Edge would be faster than her, though. Cecil, you gonna kill something? Sometime today? Thank you. About damn time. Okay. Excuse us, you have to hit a man in the face with a cooking utensil. <laughs> I should have gotten a pot handy to make the noise. Oh, don't! <laughs> Clang! There's already time for training. Let me sleep a little longer. Oh, Cecil! Yang! Oh, great! 
The Sylph saved me when I was in trouble. Your brave act saved the dwarves. I am going with you. No, you have to stay and rest. But the whole world is in danger. I cannot. It is no place for the injured, man. <laughs> Who are you? I am Prince Edge of Eblan. Much better at fighting than you, man. Mon ami? Maybe it's Mon ami. Eblan, so you are a ninja. Then I will... No, don't force yourself. We'll help them instead. Hmm? She's a caller. She can call us. We'll help you. Why, thank you. Righty learned Sylph. It is an offensive-defensive spell. It is better than Asura. I am sorry I cannot be of any help now. Aww. And that's... Yeah, yeah, you need to rest. <laughs> Humans, how violent! Rosa, get us the hell out of here. Okay. Um, now we've had a bunch of random encounters. Excalibur? This Excalibur's made out of adamantium. Maybe we could rename it the Wolverine. Weapon X. Cecil uses Weapon X. It's super effective. Eh, gimme! Come back later. Maybe it's plot related. Probably should have looked this up. Oh well. Other things to do. Uh, that's about it, really. I guess it's time to do the plot. There we go. Damn you, airship. Why oh, you gotta be so fastidious? <clears throat> see, it'd be neat if you could go see Edward and... Like, look, Edward! Righty is not dead! Edge would probably just make fun of him, though, because he's a prick. Oh, ho, ho! I am quite rude, no? Hi, Yang's wife. Oh, here's your pan back. I'm sorry for taking all your time. Take this with you. Received the spoon. Don't worry about me. Tell Yang to get well soon and fight with you. I'm not going back down there, lady. Spoon? Spoon. Spoon. Where the hell did it go? Oh, there it is. Okay, so the spoon's a throwing weapon. Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> I'm probably going to waste it on something. Let's do that or save it for the final boss. And I don't know about all that. Um, there are some things we need... Oh, crap. I need to buy some stuff because I'm an idiot. Uh, let's see. Maybe. I've got an ice brand. Um... I would like a fire sword, but I don't want to go back... Wait. No, I get that from the dwarven place. Yeah, I could go get a fire sword real quick. <clears throat> There's a thing I would not mind having a fire sword for. It's probably moot. The boss battle I'm planning on, I could probably just use Avenger, since it's just a bunch of single target. But... Elemental flexibility would not be a bad thing to have. And it's not like I'm low on funds. And I have time to kill. Uh, there we go. Dwarfs! Lalo! The tower! The tower! Makes me want to play a dwarf campaign in Warhammer. I can play the first game pretty easily. The uh, Warhammer 2 looks kind of ugly on my rig. I have to get a new computer at some point. 
a new new computer. Actually, I picked up a bunch of Shogun 2 stuff. I'll probably start playing that in the near future. Uh, has fire swords? Yes, has fire swords. Oh, we've got a ton of money. I mean, should I go buy diamond armor? I don't know. I mean, the girls are... Everyone who's squishy is well-equipped. <clears throat> I don't think the one point of defense is going to make that huge of a difference. But, as said before, we've got time. Maybe we can throw the ice armor at someone. That'd be hilarious. And uh, earlier, I could have unequipped Kane of all that stuff, but for those of you who didn't know it was going to happen, I wanted it to be a surprise. That's why I try not to do that too often with people. Uh, I did it with Cecil. Did I buy Tiaras? Huh. Come on, Cecil. Show me that 40,000 gold for one point of defense. Ooh! Not bad. Although, also, he's at 60 and Edge is at like 38, so it's a big difference. Wait, you're not the item shop. Wait a second. Oh, they're connected to each other, that's right. I was thinking there's treasure, but there isn't. It's all a lie. Item shop? Item shop! Are you in the inn? Maybe you're in the inn. So we should buy some lifes. Huh. Hmm. Oh, there we go. I was playing some with the randomizer. Uh, I was helped with some linkage. There we go. Ten ethers before I bought all this other crap. It's okay. Worst case scenario, we need to refill someone's magic. We're gonna throw an elixir at them anyway, because fifty points ain't gonna do much for their three hundred and thirty magic. Oh god, I don't want to go to the next part. It's the hard part. Because I want to do a thing that I probably shouldn't do. Well, no, I kind of can. I'm having trouble remembering events. Anyway. So, the the dwarves sent us to Mysidia. Real quick. Remember how I said a long time ago? This looks like a dragon, doesn't it? It's got wings. It's got little feets. It's even got little feets. And a tail. The very Final Fantasy thing. I wish they'd do more stuff like that. Like land masses that look like things. Anyway. Mysidia! Oh. We've been waiting for you. Come to the Tower of Wishes. Oh, goodness. Uh, are we going to do the thing again? One to be born from a dragon. Hoisting the light and the dark. Arises high up in the sky. To the still land. Veiling the moon with the light of eternity. It brings... Another promise to Mother Earth with a bounty and mercy. It's beautiful. Also, we're getting to the good part of the uh, crystal song. Wish, everyone! The legend shall now come alive! Wish, you deaf bastards! Wish like your lives depended on it. Are you wishing, everyone? Because if you don't clap your hands, Tinkerbell dies. Oh shit, it's Leviathan. Look, everyone! Our wish was granted! This I would like to see with a new cutscene. Well, I imagine 
in the advanced version, or the DS version, or the Steam version, whatever, it's a giant tempura prawn? Well, I don't see how that's going to help. I mean, it's, it's impressive. That is. It's the ship of the light from the moon. The big whale. The big what now? Okay, Final Fantasy, you're getting just a little silly right now. While wishing, I heard a voice calling you from the moon. Someone awaits you there. The moon? But how? The big whale is the ship from the moon. It works as an... No, it works as an airship. But you need to talk to the crystal. The Elder wouldn't know that. That was tutorial stuff. Anyway, tutorial stuff. Seriously? Seriously? Seriously. Well, they can get... Oh, you can only sylph one thing. Tragedy. Duff! That's actually a really good eel. It's on par with Cure 3. <clears throat> it's not quite as good as Cure 3, but it's close. Well, I guess we'll murder everything then. Cecil? Okay, thank you. Did you get your shit together? Uh, I really want to go see if Excalibur's done before we go to the moon. I'm going to go see if Excalibur's done before we go to the moon. <laughs> <laughs> then we'll come fly the giant tempura prawn. That thing is silly. <laughs> Even when I was a kid, I was enchanted by, ah, something awesome's coming out of the... It's a what? What do you mean it's a big... A big whale? What the hell does that have to do with anything? Like, it should be like a dragon or, or something. I don't know. Whatever, it's the big whale. It's gonna save the day. Is my sword ready? Apparently I'm going to the moon. I'd really like my sword. <gasps> it's done. Here's the sacred sword Excalibur. Look, just because some watery tart lobbed a scimitar at you is no basis for a form of government. Are you going to make more things? Can, can you make some adamantium ninjato? So from 104, well, what were we using? We were using defense, which is 127. And Excalibur is 100 and... <laughs> 184. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, let's, let's throw that Aegis shield back on. Well, he's not Berserk, but I think he... Hopefully he'll put, have a similar damage output that we can control now. Now, I wonder if Excalibur's time to before you leave for the moon, or if it's a time thing. I'll look it up and I will report my findings before we start the next video. But first, we gotta go to the moon and have a plot dump. Oh, the plot dump. Come on, buttered prawn. That's your name. It's got cool music, though. So that's the crystal. That takes us to the moon. Now, if we come up here, we can fly it around like a big fat airship. If we go down here, we can take a nap. Because, you know, nappy boos. Nappy boos are important. And let's go! And then down here's a fat chocobo if you want to, like, put stuff in him. If you want to put stuff inside him, he's down in the cargo hole. There should be a place to buy stuff. Like I there should be an item shop. That would be lovely. Wah. To the moon. That was easy. Okay, so we want to go here, but there's a problem. There's no easy way to get there. We need to. Okay, we need to get here. See, because we can't we can't land. We can't land on craters and rocks and shit, because we're big and lumpy. Okay. Um... Okay, so this stairway, this stairway... Well, can we just land here? Okay, no, that doesn't lead there. It's hard to see, because everything's so zoomed out. Okay, so where do we go from here? Here? Looks like up here. There's a series of caves, I believe. 
Also, we want to go here. Just not yet. Mm -hmm. That looks like a cave. Okay, that's a cave. Okay, stop. But there's a rock. Okay, so... I might just have to wander around for a little bit. I don't remember where you're supposed to park. There's not a lot of ground to cover. I just want to be careful, because shit up here sucks. Huh. Wait, I think that's a cave. Yep, there's a cave. Okay, cool. Woof. Okay, let's... Also, I don't like the music. I don't like the opening of the music, which is what you hear the most of, because of the uh, random encounter system. It's actually quite nice, though. And uh, the cave music's really good. Oh, shit. Well, that's, that's unfortunate. Oh, God, what are they? <laughs> Leviathan everything. <laughs> Keep it. They're not too dangerous. 2200. Nothing. Great. Well, that means Leviathan will. Holy shit. Go Cecil. That means. Well, that means Titan would probably kill them. Maybe Jin. Yeah, that's a little overkill. Whatever. There's no such thing as a little overkill. Oh, that was my treasure chest. So they drop elixirs? And then he farmed juicy lights for like two years. Pudding. Can you kill pudding? No. Okay, well we'll need to look at the pudding. Nope, don't do that. <laughs> Peep at the pudding! Kill the thing. A thousand. No weak points found, so I assume just magic. Get him, Jen. Oh, I suppose I could try flame. I don't think flame would do a thousand. Actually, I don't think any of his magic will do a thousand. Yeah, fire worked pretty good. That's good. Jin's fairly inexpensive. Hmm, that wasn't as good a, uh, of an experience. Whew. More treasure? Treasure! More monsters? Hey, it's the uh, Mount Ordeals music. Mmm. Curiouser and curiouser. Uh, oh yeah, the other cave was down here. <clears throat> of course you have to walk all the way back. Nope. Not dealing with that. Run your little golden boots. Poison? What the hell? Son of a bitch. Why did it kick the crap out of Rydia? Oh, I bet it... Was it the pudding, or was it the pro coyote? Let's see... Boop. Goodness. What a crock. Attack from behind two times in a row. Yeah, I guess it was him. You guys didn't poison us the first time. Eh. A thousand gold! Willikers. See, what we need in the, the big whale is, a, uh, is an airship dock. That way we can take the airship to somewhere more convenient to park.
Okay. Just in case something stupid happens. Because it's dangerous here. Oh. That wasn't so bad. Someone give me some repels. Oh, this is a crap fight. Some of those are really low level. The tofu and the uh, slime. There's a... Uh, black balloons up here, I think, somewhere. The lunar lair. Well, I think that'll wait till next time. It seems pleasant enough. Anyway, we'll find out in a minute.